How to check your CPU architecture, 32-bit x86 or 64-bit x64 in Windows 11. This is going to be a very short tutorial as getting this information is very easy. So you've decided to download a new program for your Windows PC. In my case, it's a program called Putty. You've gone to the download page and you've looked at the downloads available. Underneath the Windows installer options, you've got various versions of the Windows installer for that program. So in my case, I've got 64-bit x86, 64-bit ARM and 32-bit x86. You might be in a dilemma as to which version you need to download. To find out the CPU architecture for your Windows PC, navigate to the Windows Start icon and then right click on it. Once you've done that, click on System. You'll then be taken to your System Settings in the About section. Underneath Device Specifications, look for where it says System Type. For my Windows PC, I've got a 64-bit operating system x64 base processor. Now this is the same system type as a 64-bit operating system x86 base processor. So now that we know our system type, I'm going to go back to my browser and from the list of Windows installers available, I'm going to go with the 64-bit x86 as it's the same as the 64-bit x64 Windows operating system. So all I'm going to do is click on this hyperlink text to start the download. And there we go, Google Chrome is now downloading the PuTTY program. And now I can simply click on my browser's download icon and start the installation process by clicking on the 64-bit version of the installer that I just downloaded. And there we go, the PuTTY setup wizard has now opened. And that pretty much concludes this video on how to check your CPU architecture architecture 32-bit x86 or 64-bit x64 in Windows 11. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to give it a like, comment down below, and most importantly of all, subscribe to support the channel. I'll see you on the next video. Why is it so hard to let you go?